Good afternoon, I'm Keenan Smith. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. A coronavirus vaccine clinic administering more than 1,100 shots is happening today in Dearborn. The patients are all getting their first dose today, with second doses scheduled for April. The clinic is at the Arab Community Center for Economic and Social Services, or ACCESS. They've partnered with Blue Cross and Blue Shield and Meyer. Thousands of people have registered for vaccines, and more clinics are being scheduled. And there's a bill in the Michigan State Senate that would place restrictions on transgender high school athletes. It would ban transgender athletes from playing with the team that corresponds with their gender identity. That means it would stop transgender boys from playing on boys teams and transgender girls from playing on girls teams. At least 13 Republicans support the bill so far. Right now, it's not clear, though, how the measure would be enforced or what penalties would be imposed if the bill were to become law. And Jeep is revealing the rebirth of the Wagoneer. Now, there are two models, the 2022 Wagoneer and the Grand Wagoneer. They have three rows of seats and will compete with the Cadillac Escalade and the Lincoln Navigator. Prices start at just under $58,000 for the Wagoneer, but a fully loaded Grand Wagoneer would cost you more than 100000 bucks. But they are good-looking rides. <laughs> Well, temperatures today in the 60s into the early afternoon, but falling once the cold front comes through by the evening. That cold front will bring scattered showers, isolated thunder, very windy conditions across the area. Much cooler by the weekend. Highs only in the 40s Saturday and Sunday.